welcome to another episode. This one again is about a new realization that I had just today. I went to a an affirmation meditation and it was absolutely amazing by the way. If you haven't if you haven't ever been to one, you totally should. Um, it kind of you go through different parts of your body from your toes all the way up to your head um, and you basically you tense your muscles up and then release and it it sets your whole body to like really relax and for me like i i do a lot like i'm not gonna lie and i, I know how to relax um but sometimes it's something i struggle with and <clears throat> i was flat out like almost by the end of it i was like oh my gosh i'm not gonna wake up like how am i gonna wake up because i was hosting an event afterwards um and I was really concerned. I was like sitting on the couch, like a really, really comfy couch too, with my head like back like this and my eyes closed. And I was totally clonked out. Like I was conscious obviously of what was going on because I was listening and reading, um, well, what's the word? Repeating, that's the word I was looking for. The things that were being said. Um, and then, so yeah, so I knew what was going on, but I was just so clunked out. I was like, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna wake up. So it was, it was absolutely amazing. Um, so anyway, after this meditation, we we got to speaking about um, how impactful um, deep breaths can be because throughout the whole thing, it was a case of we were taking a deep breath in and out. But like, yeah, I've, I've noticed a lot from meditations that I do at home by myself that pretty much all of them, they, they tell you to breathe in through your nose and um, quite often will hold it as well. And then you have to breathe out through your mouth. And it's something that I have struggled with for a while as well because um, it just doesn't it doesn't feel natural it's not something that comes normally to us I guess because as a species I feel like we're quite stressed all the time like there's always something to be tense about whether it's you know we've got work to do um, or we're behind or there's some conflict going on between family members or maybe a partner sorry that's just my cat dribbles trying to get in the way um, and yeah but it's such a small thing and as i was talking to my friends we were talking about smoking um and it just suddenly like a light bulb moment happened and i was like oh my goodness like i think the reason why people turn to smoking to calm themselves down could have a lot to do with the fact that when you smoke obviously you're inhaling deeply and then quite a lot of people hold their breath as well and then they breathe it out um and it makes complete sense like our bodies are able to heal themselves like I really strongly believe that but obviously we have to trust ourselves and listen to our, our intuition and what our body is trying to tell us um this is in like all concepts I really believe that wholeheartedly um and then yeah, it's just something that just randomly came to me and I was like, she made a comment about, you know, that her point she made was the fact that actually, in a sense, smoking is good because at least it's teaching your body that by breathing in deeply and then out, that is teaching itself to calm. But obviously you have all the chemicals and things that are really not good for your body in the cigarette. But it just really made me think, like, maybe if people learn to be more conscious of their breathing and you know in those moments where you're like you want to pull your hair out or you know you're overwhelmed and you just don't know what to do and you don't you know you never stop those kinds of things if we just took a bit more time to stop and you know i feel it works better when you close your eyes personally especially for me um and just take a big breath in and hold it and then exhale um, 
and it really makes a massive difference. Like I felt, I mean, I feel I've been feeling pretty good the last few days anyway, but there's, there's a part of me that I'm going through something not so great in my brain, although I haven't quite figured out what it is, but I felt like a massive weight had been lifted off me just because I spent I spent an hour doing this and I know that's a long time and I don't necessarily mean that you have to spend every single day like taking an hour out to go do deep breathing that's just not practical is it but just every once in a while to just stop like have a real intense workout of you know taking deep breaths um, and just letting the things go, like with your breaths, I suppose, as well. But yeah, it's just something that really was like, aha, you know, and I'm, I, I wanted to share. So it's just something to think about. I mean, I've been thinking about it a lot and I've, you know, proven I've learned myself from my own experience now that how powerful it really is. Um, I was aware, I think, but today it just really resonated with me yes this is something that needs to be shared with my bloomers like so there it is um i hope you get something out of it hopefully as much as me but there we go that's it for today's episode thank you guys so much for joining and listening and i will see you soon